I want to head back out to Carteret County now. As I mentioned earlier, high winds and rain all along the Crystal Coast. WNCT's Brandon Truitt is in Moorhead City with a live look at conditions there. The area has been without power now for several hours, Brandon. Yeah, Ken and Shayla, we're finally able to kind of get out here and show you what we've been talking about. That debris we're talking about, a good example, just setting this up. This is blown off of someone's porch and just came up against our car here. Now, don't let it fool you where I'm standing. It's kind of a cutoff. I'm being blocked from a lot of the wind. Let me step out of the way and show you behind me, though. We're hoping that you'll be able to see this, kind of seeing some of the movement of the wind, just like this gust right here. And it comes in and out, back and forth. And this is the stuff just when we were on the phone with you about 15 minutes ago. We were not experiencing this, but in the time it took us to kind of set up the shot and try to give you guys this live look, we have just seen the change again. These bands, just like Jerry and Alyssa are telling us, coming in and out, this unpredictability really of a hurricane, and we're seeing that play out for us. But so far, this wind and rain causing a little bit of damage. It's going to be hard for us to see. We can't really get a shot because so much of the power is out. This parking lot would normally be lit at this time, but that's not the case. Is of course, Carteret County really sitting in the dark right now as um, almost everyone has lost power. But these gusts, we're hoping you can hear it as well. Just coming in as strong as could be. I'm going to step back in front of the camera here as we. Uh, sorry. Yeah, some of the wind coming in uh, pretty aggressively. Ken and Shayla, I'll get it back to you.